Venezuela in the news. News from the Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela. Headlines. Caracas will fully assume the presidency of the Southern Common Market. Colombia-Venezuelan border will remain closed. The Venezuelan government denounced the breaking of the stability in the region by Paraguay, Brazil and Argentina. Venezuelan President Nicolás Maduro assured that Venezuela will fully assume the rotating presidency of the Southern Common Market, role that corresponds to the country for the next six months. Maduro accused the governments of Argentina, Brazil and Paraguay for attacking Venezuela and wanting to prevent it from assuming its social role in the trade organization. Maduro highlighted, quote, We are president of the Mercosur and we are going to exercise it fully. The coordinators of the member nations of the Mercosur met on Thursday in Montevideo with the absence of the Venezuelan representation and without any consensus among its members in regards to the controversy over Venezuela assuming the pro-temporary presidency of the trade bloc. The Venezuelan government's representation did not attend the meeting in rejection of the convening that violates the internal statutes of the group, which highlight to proceed in its alphabetical rotation every six months. The Colombia-Venezuelan border will remain closed until further notice, confirmed by Bogota in a meeting held Thursday in Caracas. Several issues were addressed, but a date has still not been set to open the border to free transit. The Venezuelan president, Nicolás Maduro, explained that the meeting was very successful, but didn't give further details. Maduro and the Colombian Minister of Foreign Affairs, María Ángela Holguín, met in the Palace of Miraflores to discuss the issue. Before the border was closed, over 100,000 barrels of oil crossed daily and illegally, and 40% of the products of the basic food basket subsidized by Venezuela also were taken to Colombia by smuggling mafias. Documents presented in Caracas demonstrated that Colombia was importing smuggled gasoline from Venezuela. There still isn't any information about a future encounter between Nicolás Maduro and his Colombian counterpart, Juan Manuel Santos. Only 28 presidents confirmed to attend the opening ceremony of the Rio 2016 Olympic Games, as confirmed by several news agencies. The amount is far fewer than the heads of state who attended the 2012 London Games, who were over 100. From neighboring countries, only the president of Argentina and Paraguay will attend. The agencies also reported that there is a, quote, low level of interest among the heads of state on holding bilateral meetings with a de facto president, Michael Temer. From the European countries, French President François Hollande will attend, as well as the heads of states of Portugal and Germany. Venezuela in the news. The Venezuelan government announced that Paraguay, Brazil and Argentina formed a triple alliance to exclude Venezuela and to destroy the stability in the region. President Nicolás Maduro stated that there is a persecution held by the corrupt and drug trafficking Paraguayan oligarchy as well as from the president of Argentina, Mauricio Macri. In response to Caracas' accusations, the Paraguayan diplomatic representative in the Venezuelan capital was recalled for consultations by his country's authorities. National Electoral Council official Tania D'Amelio denounced that the institution will not be coerced to rush the recall referendum promoted by the Democratic Unity Opposition Party Coalition, MUD. D'Amelio informed that for the moment, the Electoral Council is fulfilling the requirements of the first stage of the request to activate the process against President Nicolás Maduro, according to the constitutional rules. The expert explained that the opposition did not begin the process when it was supposed to and denounced that the MUD is deceiving the population. Now it cannot blame the National Electoral Council, she said. News from the Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela. Headline. Caracas will fully assume the presidency of the Southern Common Market. Colombia-Venezuelan border will remain closed. The Venezuelan government denounced the breaking of the stability in the region by Paraguay, Brazil and Argentina. Venezuela in the news. News from the Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela. Visión Comunal. En contacto con las comunidades.